All right, guys. So, 2022, question three, um, answer solutions. All right. Let's just get right into it. It's and it's a manufacturing question, by the way. All right. So, you know, you may want to shape up on your manufacturing accounts. So it says, Rael Manufacturing Company manufactures automobile parts model AF2. The following information is available for the direct cost used to manufacture one automobile AF2 part, right? So they give us the direct cost, they give us the direct material and the direct labor. Now they go ahead and they said, okay, um, seven kilogram of steel bought at a cost of $11 per kilogram. So I went ahead and I calculated what it would cost, right, 47 kilogram of steel, which is 77. So you will multiply the seven by the 11 to get the 77. And then the labor cost, it says two hours in the cutting department, three hours in the polishing department, right? And it says all labor is paid at the rate of $15 per hour. Right, so I went ahead and I did the calculations for that. So these these three are just rough calculations. Right, you don't have to have those, right? But they are my rough calculations. They went ahead and say calculate the total direct cost of producing one AF two automobile part, right? So the total direct cost of producing one AF um part is basically what I had done here already, right? I had done the work out here already, so it made it easier. So the direct material would add up to $77, the direct labor would add up to 75, so it would be 152. So total direct cost for one AF2 would be $152, right? I forgot my dollar sign right there, all right? Then they ask us to calculate the total direct cost of producing 800 AF2 automobile parts. So that is simple. All that we will need to do, we know how much it is to calculate to do one, which is $152, right? Um, and so what we do, we just multiply it by 800 and we get $121,600, right? $121,600, sorry, 600, all right? So that's six marks, right? Pretty straightforward. Then move on to part B of the question. It says the following information has been extracted from the books of Royal Manufacturing Company for the year ended the 30th of April 2022. So they give us the factory wages, factory overheads, administrative expenses, um, purchases of raw materials, purchases returns of raw materials. They give us the opening inventory and the opening work in progress. That's right here. Opening inventory, opening work in progress, right? And then they give us the closing inventory, closing work in progress, right? And then they give us revenue. Revenue here, guys, it would be sales. And we would use that when we are doing the income statement for the manufacturing firm, all right? So we are given that information. Then on the next page, they said that we should use the information, right, to prepare an extract showing calculations to arrive at the cost of raw material used for the year ended, the 30th of April. So they're really asking for the first part of the manufacturing account. So you would start off with the open stock of raw material, right? Then you would add your purchases of raw material, your list your purchases returns, then you have your cost of raw materials available, and then you list your closing stock of raw materials, and then this is now your cost of raw material use, which is what they had asked you for, right? So they say you should what? Show how you arrive at the cost of raw material use. So that is what we did. Right, and we arrive at it here. And so you get the four marks. So they're basically testing your knowledge of you know the manufacturing account. All right. So we're going four and six, that's 10 out of the 20. So we already passed the question by just doing those two. All right. So it says prepare the manufacturing, the company's manufacturing account to show the total cost of production of manufactured goods, right? For the year ended. And we really what they are asking us to do is the other side of the manufacturing account, right? But they just break it up into two parts, right? So it's still the manufacturing account that we are on. So we will continue from the cost of raw materials used right there. So we continue. So here it is, cost of raw materials used, right? And we just finish the manufacturing account. So we add our factory overheads, sorry, add our other direct, um, direct cost, which is factory wages, right? Factory wages. 
Yeah. See there. Factory wages. Factory wages is the same as um production workers pay, right? It's the same as production workers pay. So you add it and you get your prime cost. Then you add your your indirect cost. They, they give it to you. So it's, it's right there. Factory over it. For so you add that and then you get this figure, right? Then you will add your opening work in progress and you list your closing work in progress. And then you would get your production cost CD, right? So that's the eight marks right there, right? And then we move on to the last question, right? It says, during the year ended the 30th of April, 2022, Royal Manufacturing Company produced 50,000, sorry, AF2 automobile parts. Use the total cost of production. Figure to calculate the unit cost of producing one AF2 automobile part in the year ended the 30th of April 2022. Right? So this is the total cost of production. And you need to understand this formula. Total cost of production is production cost divided by the number of units. The number of units in this question, um, what they just give is what 50,000. So this is the number of units, right? The total production cost is. 425,000, right? So you divide 425,000 by 50,000 and you get $8.50. So this is how much it would cost you to produce one unit, right? And that's it, right? And if you ask me the difficulty level of this question, it's, it's really not that difficult. Um, They just require more of you in terms of your analysis skills. So what I would say is it's important for you to practice I would give this question a six out of 10 as it relates to difficulty, right? Um, keep practicing. I'll, come in, I'll be coming up soon with part four, all right? So stay tuned and walk good.